हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स इन ट्रिक नंबर थ्री जीरो फाइव आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस टू इम्पॉर्टेंट प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ मार्क प्राइस एंड डिस्काउंट नाउ दिस टॉपिक फाइंड्स एप्लीकेबिलिटी फ्रॉम क्लास एट ऑनवर्ड्स एंड इन कॉम्पिटिटिव एग्जाम्स ऑब्वियसली दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन आर आज वेरी वेरी फ्रीक्वेंटली सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन यर नाउ द क्वेश्चन इज आफ्टर अलाउंग ए डिस्काउंट ऑफ ट्वेल्व परसेंट ऑन द मार्क प्राइज an article is sold for rupees 880 so a shopkeeper is giving a discount of 12% on the mark price the item which is written on the article and the selling price of the article is 880 after allowing a discount of 12% so we have to find what is the mark price now very common question very easy question and you need to solve this in 10 seconds if you need to succeed in competitive exams now here i go see we have to find the mark price so whenever mark price is to be found out just remember discount is always calculated on the mark price and if you remember this formula then most of the questions of discount will be easy for you mark price minus discount percent of mark price gives you the selling price so if you understand this formula that from the mark price we subtract the discount calculated on the mark price this is the discount and if we subtract np minus discount then you get the selling price of the article now see what is given in the question we have to find the mark price i'll assume this as x minus discount percent is c here 12% so 12% of mark price mark price is x gives you the selling price selling price is 880 so very easy equation 100 minus 12 is 88 upon 100 x is equal to 880 and you can cut this now 10 times and if you cross multiply you get rupees 1000 therefore the mark price of the article is rupees 1000 with little practice you can find mark price of articles when discount and selling price are given orally also and if you want to use the pen and pen and paper then it will take you hardly 3 to 4 seconds if you do a practice of half an hour on this concept now come to the second question now here in this question the shopkeeper is giving a discount of 10% but even after giving the discount of 10% he is making some profit and that profit is 26% now we need to find the cost price of an article which is marked at rupees 280 so the shopkeeper has marked an article for rupees at rupees 280 and on 280 he is giving a discount of 10% but even at that selling price he is making a profit of 26% so we need to find out the cost price of the article now see here we are given the marked price marked at rupees 280 so marked price of the article is given as rupees 280 and the discount percent is 10 percent. Now see again, I have used this formula which I just now told you. Now this is the formula: mark price minus discount percent of mark price gives you the selling price. So I will apply the same formula here. Now see, mark price minus d percent of mark price gives you selling price. So mark price here is 280 minus 10 percent of 280 now this will give you the selling price so 280 minus 10% of 280 just put one uh, decimal for one digit from the right side this is 28 so the selling price comes out to be rupees 252 now you have found out the selling price now if you know how to relate selling price and profit profit is given 26% now this profit is always calculated on the cost price discount is always calculated on the mark price and the profit is always calculated on the cost price so now cost price added to the profit so profit percent of cost price gives you the selling price and now this is the important formula which we will be using for finding the cost price so cost price let us suppose that the cost price is x profit percent is 26% so 26% of x gives you the selling price selling price is 
52. Now you can solve this very easily. This is 126 upon 100 x is equal to 252. Now see 126 goes exactly two times. So if you cross multiply you will get your final answer here. So your x is 200 rupees. So the cost price of the article comes out to be 200 rupees. That implies cost price is rupees 200. Now this is how you solve the questions based on discount. These are very basic questions of discount and little bit of understanding will enable you to solve these in minimum amount of time. So if you like it, share it and subscribe the channel.